STS-51J was the 21st NASA Space Shuttle mission and the first flight of Space Shuttle Atlantis. It launched from Kennedy Space Center, Florida, on 3 October 1985, carrying a payload for the U.S. Department of Defense, and landed at Edwards Air Force Base, California, on 7 October. Crew Topic Backup Crew Topic Crew Notes Before William Pales was assigned to the STS-51J flight, Richard M. Mullen was rumored to have been assigned as Mission Specialist 3 on his second trip to space. <laughs> <laughs> Mission summary STS-51J launched on 3 October 1985, at 11.15 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, from Launch Pad 39A at the Kennedy Space Center. The launch was delayed by 22 minutes and 30 seconds due to a problem with a main engine liquid hydrogen provalve close remote power controller, the controller was showing a faulty on indication. The mission was the second shuttle flight totally dedicated to deploying a Department of Defense payload, after STS-51C. Its cargo was classified, but it was reported that two USA-11 and USA-12 DSCS-3 Defense Satellite Communications System satellites were launched into stationary orbits by an inertial upper stage. The DSCS satellites used X-band frequencies 8 sevenths of a gigahertz. Each DSCS-3 satellite had a design life of 10 years, although several of the DSCS satellites have far exceeded their design life expectancy. The mission was deemed successful. After a flight lasting 4 days, 1 hour and 45 minutes, Atlantis landed on runway 23 at Edwards Air Force Base at 1300 Eastern Daylight Saving Time on 7 October 1985. During STS-51J, Mission Commander Carol Bobko became the first astronaut to fly on three different shuttle orbiters, and the only astronaut to fly on the maiden voyages of two different orbiters. Topic. See also List of human spaceflights List of space shuttle missions <laughs>